It is the 26th of June, a day observed the world over as the International Day Against Drug Abuse, a menace that is plaguing societies the world over. In India, the Kashmir Valley is one of it, the worst hit regions. Thanks to cross-border drug peddling from Pakistan, the authorities have now launched a massive crackdown on drug peddlers across the Union territory. Here's a ground report on the challenge and the efforts to combat the menace. In a recent study, Kashmir Valley alone in the Union Territory surpassed every other state in India to emerge among the two states in the country with regards to drug abuse. And one of the most common drugs used here is heroin. It was revealed in the study that Kashmir at number two in the national rankings for drug abuse has left behind Punjab, which was considered to be the hub until recently. According to a top police official in the Union Territory, over 5,000 cases have been registered in the last few years against drug peddlers. The action is making a difference on the ground, but the drug mafia is so huge that it will take a lot of time for the administration to clean up the mess. However, experts say that coordination between stakeholders in the valley is showing results on the ground. Not only has the availability of drugs in the markets gone down, but also the number of addicts seeking treatment has gone up. The addiction centers across the valley are witnessing an increase in the number of those seeking help. The study has also revealed that big money was involved in the valley's drug business. Doctors say that 88,000 rupees is being spent every month by every drug user involved in opiates. Drug users in the valley to perceive a change in the scene. They say that drug availability in the market has gone down. Previously, the drugs were easily available. But after action by the police and administration, there has been a change on ground. The prices of these drugs have also gone up. I started in 2016. I had an accident and was at home and my friends used to visit me and they gave it to me. They didn't even know how to use it. But then we met some people who taught us how to use heroin. I was fully an addict by 2017. The study has revealed that the bulk of those given to use drugs are in the age group of 17 to 33 and they are mostly from among the unemployed. The most commonly used psychoactive substance was opioids. The study also shows that in all 10 districts, more than 67,000 showed patterns of dependence on psychoactive substances. Of these, more than 5,000 were found to be opioid dependent and heroin was the predominant illicit drug of choice among opioid users. Most of the drug users in the valley say that action needs to be taken against the peddlers and that is how the menace of drugs could be curbed in the valley. According to them, if the addict does not get the drugs, it will solve all the issues. With me, I started with medicinal opiates. I shifted to brown sugar and then to heroin. I left a year ago. It was so easily available, especially in the outskirts of Srinagar and an area close to Sangam. Sometimes even girls would sell it to us. There are many whose deaths have been caused by drug overdose in the valley and 30 to 40 percent of the addicts suffer from symptoms of overdose. The majority of overdose cases were suffering from hepatitis C disease due to severe damage of the liver. The Jammu and Kashmir police has recovered illicit drugs worth crores of rupees in the last few months from various parts of the Union territory. Police say that most of the drugs come from across the border from Pakistan. Many such consignments were recovered from areas close to the line of control, like Kupwara and Uri. A lot of these were dropped in different parts of Jammu by drones from across the international border. Bureau Report, Weon, World is One. Weon is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.